Dust is hard. I don't know what it was gonna be. Hi, yeah, my name's Georgia Flynn, and I'm soon to be travelling backpacker for the first time ever. Ooh. My video is gonna tell you all about the stuff that I will be doing because no doubt I'm gonna make a shitload of mistakes. So, the places I'm gonna be going Thailand, Woo. Vietnam, Cambodia, maybe Laos. I don't know. I did plan to go to India, but I cancelled my flights because I got scared. Simply because I've never been in front of a camera before. I've prepared some little paper, 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 paper papers that I'm going to put into a hat. Give them a shake. Oh shit, the bed. Jesus. And I'm just going to answer them based on what I know about my trip because I don't actually know a lot because to be honest I don't know if I've planned enough <laughs> what will I be doing? well my only plan in Thailand to be honest is to ride on an elephant and sit on a beach so the answer to what I will be doing is I will be sitting on my arse on a beach hopefully drinking beer Maybe I'll visit the temple. Yeah. Transport and accommodation. So transport and accommodation. I booked my flights through STA Travel, which I found were a proper good A. <laughs> proper good A. They're very good, and just because I was a student at the time of booking them, they were really cheap. I think they're about £675. I got them as a graduation present, so cheers, parents. Um, but yeah, they were really cheap, really easy to book. Um, I just went in. They told me that I couldn't afford to go around the world, so I didn't go around the world. I was just going to Thailand. But I haven't been yet. I'm going to Thailand. We booked two nights at a hotel in Bangkok and then I'm trying to book a train from Bangkok to go to Mui but <laughs> my booking skills are not too good. Jabs. 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 I had jabs from the NHS. I went in, told them where I was going and I got a mix of typhoid and hep A. The nurse said I should probably get Hep B, but they cost like £80 a jab and you have to get three before you go, like months before you go, and I'm going in 13 days. So it was kind of like an, oh shit. But I'm just gonna live on the edge. Um, I'm probably gonna order some malaria tablets. Um, yeah. I mean, they could be quite useful. I don't want malaria. Where I plan on going? So, I fly into Bangkok on the 15th of September after a very long flight. And then I'm gonna meet my brother who is gonna come with me. He's going to Singapore and Dubai first. And then he's gonna come meet me for like, 20 days or something and we plan on going to in this order precisely <laughs> let, me get my, let me get my book my book knows everything nope not you for fuck's sake for book's sake <laughs> oh fuck that so we're gonna go from Bangkok, we're gonna go Bangkok to Koh Samui, then Phuket. I don't really know if I'm pronouncing these right. Then we're gonna go to Koh Lanta, then we're gonna go Koh Phi Phi, Koh Banyang, Koh Sok, and then he's gonna fly back to Bangkok. Koh Sok, Bangkok, Koh Sok, Bangkok. He's gonna leave me. And I'm probably just gonna wing it. I 
I think I might go from Bangkok to Cambodia. It ain't gonna be either, but I don't really know. Shake it, shake, shake it, shake it. Top five bucket list. Hmm. Ride an elephant, number one, as soon as I get there. But an elephant that's been treated nicely, of course. See a temple. Dress up in orange and pretend I'm a Buddha. Finally, learn how to surf, because every time I bloody try, I end up on my arse. Um, Survive a tuk tuk because they look fucking dangerous. Things I'll miss from home. My family, of course. My family, of course. My friends. My bed. My laptop. This is making me sound like such a knob. Things I am going to pack. Well, as most women are. I tend to think that I'm not going to need anything but then I end up packing my entire fucking wardrobe. So I'm going to try and be different. So I'm taking a backpack and then I'm taking a day say, which is this, which was 25 quid. And then I'm going to try and take, I went to Primark, good old Primark, and I bought from good old Primarni. <laughs> a shameless £67 worth of basic t-shirts, basic shorts, and shit. Travel, travel, travel bandana, travel, travel, travel bandana. See, if you put a bandana on, then everyone's like, she's a backpacker. I also bought these shoes. Should I ever feel the need to go on a jungle hike? Which I probably should, but I'm really, really unfit. So, bitch, I got some have have a really don't know how to pronounce this. Havanas, Havianas, have a fucking flip flop. These things. Some turns. You're welcome, child in Africa. <laughs> Some bikinis, got some bikinis. Now these are the best things ever, because they're like pants, but they're also shorts. Short. So the pants, and then the zip, like detaches. <laughs> the proper like, look at that, look at this. Excellent. Now this. It's my favourite purchase, simply because it makes me look like a twit. So I got this little belt that goes under your clothes. Whoa. But I'm going to put it over. How nifty am I? Yeah. And the rest of my stuff is just kind of things like this, which they're just, you know, essential. One thing I want to buy, if I really could, I'd buy an elephant, but I don't think that's going to happen. I want to buy, 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 buy. Probably, I'm obsessed with necklaces like this, so I'll probably buy some of them. Some of those pants with like random patterns on them, even though I've already got fucking loads. My budget! So, I've been reading a lot of travel blogs on like Lonely Planet, Travel Fish, and just Googling shitloads of budgets and everybody has a different budget but to be honest since I've only just graduated uni I am hashtag broke and my budget is kind of low 
So I budgeted about 1,700 for my entire trip. So I don't know. I'm taking like 800 pound on a. I really shouldn't be telling people this. Nope. I'm not gonna tell you. But I did. I'm gonna. I will tell you. I bought me a STA. Whoa travel cash card, it cost £22, they'll replace it if you ever lose it, so I'm going to whack a bit of cash on there, so hopefully that'll be alright, mate, Thailand dollar makes you feel like you're balling, oh. here my $500 bill, here another $500 bill, here another, here another, here another, so 500 Thai, bot, bat, twat, hat, whatever it's called, is £9.42. The last one! The last one. Is... Three favourite travel items. Well, I'm talking to one, like a little psychopath which is my camera because you can't really go anywhere unless you've got your camera so number one is my Nikon D7100 number two is this bad boy <laughs> so I just think it's fucking fantastic and number three is I want to say smartphone, but I don't want to say smartphone because I don't want to spend any time on the phone. So I'm going to say... My... Headphones? No? No, 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 no. This? Probably? Because it's going to come in use. It's a block of things that I don't yet understand. Oh look, it's called maps. So anyway, I'm gonna be blogging, vlogging, schwogging over, I'm going to Thailand in two weeks, I'm going for three months, well two and a half months-ish, and I'm gonna be blogging about everything that I do over there, how long I can survive without getting arrested, um, just basically a bit of everything. I'm gonna try and learn some Thai, which <laughs> not gonna happen but if you can stand listening to me chat shit for longer than five minutes subscribe to this channel and I will be back to you with more tell your mom tell your dad tell your auntie tell your uncle tell your sister tell your dog tell your cousin let's go let's go hey Oscar I'm making a YouTube channel pay attention Subscribe, bitches. Subscribe.